This video will show you how to install Python on a Mac. So the first thing you have to do is make sure you're connected to the internet and open your browser of choice. That could be Safari or Google Chrome or Firefox. Then um, let's start off by going to Google and you can search for install Python. Okay, you should get these results. It will say download Python. Click on this one. And here it says download the latest version for Mac OS X. So the version we are using is Python 3.5.1. So click that link. And depending on your browser, it will come up as a download here in the top right for Safari or it will appear here in the bottom left I think for um, Google Chrome or here again for Firefox so it's 24 megabytes it should download pretty quickly just wait for that to download and then we'll move on to the next step alternatively you could have gone instead of googling this you could have just gone to www.python.org forward slash downloads Okay, so our file has finished downloading. We can see that by clicking on the uh, Show Downloads button up here, and we can see that it's complete. So double-click on that, and it will start the installer. All you have to do is keep clicking Continue to get through this to install the program. So we click through the first screen, then we click Continue on the second screen, Continue on the third screen, we have to agree to the license. Then we choose a destination, so probably you'll only have one option. So click on your um, drive here, probably called C. Click continue, and then click install. And if uh, you don't know the password for your computer, ask your parents to see what that is. Get them to put the password in. Then click install software and it will go through the installation process and eventually it will say the installation was successful so we can close this and now you might be thinking where is Python well remember the program is called idle so on a Mac you can search for something by clicking in the top right here the spotlight search function and searching for idle Okay, and then the best thing to do is to drag this into your dock, which is usually at the bottom of the screen. So you can drag it here, put it in the dock. You can see I already have mine there, and let go. And then you can get to it very quickly by just putting your cursor at the bottom and clicking on idle. 